everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Sanaa, all dialed up by Sanaa, so crafty Sanaa, and I am back with my weekly expense video. So, first things first, if you are new to my channel, thank you guys so much for tuning in. And if you are returning, hey, you guys know how much I appreciate you. But don't forget, please subscribe, like, and comment if you have anything you need to say. Yes, your girl is trying to grow her community why not so if you have a friend let a friend know and then let another friend know tune in okay so um i am going to be selling out the weekly expenses from the 13th through the 19th these i did already i did it off camera because i didn't have time to film and i just needed to clear out my wallet and i just have to update that so I did not do a lot of spending and any spending I did after the 19th will be done and settled out for Friday. So what I do, if you are new to my channel or in case you forgot, I am a credit card user. I do use cash envelopes, but I only use my credit card to get back my cash back rewards. So if you guys ever watched any of my cash stuffing videos and you see at the end of the month when I do that reward cash, that is money I get back from using my credit card and paying it off each week is what you see. So I do know for a fact that as of February through October the 31st, I have $1,130 in reward cash in an envelope. As a matter of fact, seeing is believing. Seeing is believing. Here is my reward cash envelope. Okay. This is from February through October, and this totals, hold on, as of October 31st, $1,130.11. So, the method to my madness is, I use my credit card for everything, and then every week I pay back my spending. And I try to do my best to pay it back to zero. I mean, to stick to the envelopes. I mean, I can pay it back to zero, no doubt, but I want to stick to... The money that I have saved in envelopes, which you will see. So, what I'm going to do now is tally up all of my spending. Um, so, my categories this week are dining, home decor, food, kids, snacks, and selfie. Selfie, so not. That's just a personal, like, maintenance, hair, nails, you know, me. A maintenance type thing. Okay. So, as we can see, dining out is $49.64. Home decor is $61.01 plus $146.48 equals. So home decor is $207.49. Okay. And then we have food, which is $55.24. Oh my gosh. $55.24 is food. Kids is $13.49. Uh-oh, home decor is wrong because I see $35. So plus $35. So that is $242.49. Okay. Oh yeah. You girls always shopping. Snacks is $20.89. And selfie is $5.18. I don't know what I bought. Probably, I don't know. So this is my spending for the week. And let me just total it up. Just see what it is. So we have. 49.64 plus 242.49 plus 55.24 plus 13.49 plus 20.89 mm -mm -mm, plus 5.18 and that gives me $386.93. Okay, we are going to do our best to settle out those expenses, okay? So dining is in my wallet. This is Parker. And um, let's see what we have. Let's see what we have in food. Oh my gosh, y'all. I have no money in food. So that's easy. We're going to, no, dining. I'm sorry. Well, I, I don't, let's see what we have in dining. Doesn't look like I have any money in dining. 10, 50, okay. 10, so I have 10, 20, 25, 26. So I have $26 in dining. That's not good. So I have $26 in dining. I'm just going to sit this to the side, okay? 
Um, home decor. Well, let me just see. Food, I already know that I don't have any money in food. That sucks. Snacks. Let's see what we have in snacks. I need $20.89. So I have $10, $20. So I do have $20. So I'm going to take $20 from snacks. Okay. And I have $10 left in snacks. So I'll put the $10 back. What in the world? Okay. So I have $10 in snacks. And so we see dining, decor, food, kids, selfie. Okay, so that is it for Parker. So let's see. Kids. Is kids in here? But I think home decor is in here. So, home decor. So, we need $242.49. So, my home remodel envelope is here. So, we need $242.49. So, I know I had to take this money, so I really had to, for the sake of keeping things in order, I had to swap out a $500 placeholder so that my cash could settle up and put the $500 back in because I needed to break it. I didn't have enough cash. I know, I know, I know. But I knew this would happen, but so. I have my $1,000 placeholder. So I have 100, 150, 200, 250, 300, 320, 340, 360, 380, 400, 420, 440, 460, 480, 500, 510, 520, 530, 540, 545, 550. So $1,550, is that what we have? Yes, so I need $242. So let's see how this is gonna go. One, two, three. So 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 120, 140, 160, 180, 200, 200, 210, 220, 230, 240. I'll take 245, okay. So I'm gonna take $245 from Home Remodel. Let me just write this down. Okay, so now I have 1,000, so 11, 1150, 12, 1250, 13, 1305, $1,305. Well, I saved this money for a reason, so, and it is, home remodel slash decor so there you have it so minus 245 and i have 1305 dollars left in home remodel slash decor okay so kids i need a selfie in here luxury kids so i need kids and selfie so Alrighty, so selfie, I need $5.18. Let's see what we have. My envelopes are busted. So I have 20, 40, 45. So I'm gonna take the five to cover whatever that was. I don't even know what I bought. Ugh, I just gotta do 11, 19, minus five and that leaves 40. I'll have to clear that out. Kids, let's see if we have anything in kids. So kids, it says 1349 and I have $15 in kids. So I don't have any ones. Let me see if I can get change. I think I can get change from reward cash. So let me see if I have five ones. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. So I'm going to take that five from kids and put it in here. Okay. And put that back. Alrighty. So kids was $13.49. So I'm just going to take 13 because I overpaid a home decor. So 10, 11, 12, 13 is going out of kids. And I'm just going to write 13. And so we have $2 left in kids. All right. So 
minus 13 and we have two. Okay, so food. So I'm left to do, let's see, $5. I am left for $55.24 plus $23. So 55 plus 23. So let's see. So that is $78, I believe. I'm gonna go over to my buffer envelope. I'm gonna go to my buffer. Wait. I'm sorry, I am making a huge mess. So let me go to buffer and see what we have in buffer. So in buffer, I have 50, 70, 90, 100, 105. And I need $78. I need 55 plus 23 is 78. So I'm gonna take 50, 20, 70. I'm gonna take 75. Oh no, I need 78. So I'm gonna take 80 and then I'm gonna give myself back $2, okay? So I took $78. So I'm gonna minus 78 and I have 20, 25, 26, 27. So I have $27 left in buffer. So I should have now covered all of my spending for the week. And as we know, I spent $386.93. Let's see what we have. Okay. Oh, great. I always do this, but I don't have any hundreds, so this should be fine. Okay, and then I'll put the ones, okay. Let's see. It looks like it's more than that, but uh, probably because it's just a lot of bills. Okay. So, I'm pretty sure I covered everything, so let's see. 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 150, 170, 190, 210, 230, 250, 270, 280, 290, 300, 310, 320, 330, 340, 350, 360, 370, 375, 380, 385, 386, 387, $386.93, $387. All of my spending has been covered. That was a success, right? So now I'm just gonna go and write down that I paid all of these and that is it and that is 147 and that is 387 dollars yay me okay so now I can get ready and stuff some cash please stay tuned for my cash stuffing video again please don't leave this channel without subscribing like and comment if you want to holler at your girl bye